pray for your family in square that will be faithful and loyal to God and they will uphold the Constitution and the law. And the further square that will be conscientiously and partially and do the best of my ability to discharge my duties as minister. So help me God. Corey brings a wealth of experience in this area. He has been a community activist. He doesn't have a lot of gray hair yet, but for over 20 years. And, and certainly my knowledge of him as a community activist predates his involvement in the calling programs. He's been able to work with people at all levels. And he and the team that he will have in the Office of the Attorney General will do the coordination. As I said, we've been doing multiple things in multiple areas, but what we found was that they were not gelling together and they were not coordinating sufficiently. And therefore, and they don't necessarily see it as crime prevention, they just see it as a social program. So in bringing everything together and coordinating it all in one, we believe that we can get greater efficiency and effectiveness. The reality is there seems to be a lot of misunderstanding of what the role is about, but if you think about it, there are many things happening in the government, there are many things happening in civil society and the third sector. That requires coordination. There's also a lot of things that need to be done, and that requires action. And my role is really to coordinate and bring action to those things that are not happening that speaks directly to crime prevention in the short, medium, and long term. And that is what I'm about to roll up my sleeve and get down to today. When people talk about qualifications, I don't even want them to think about my honors degree in sociology. I want them to think of the 24 years of experience working in this society, understanding the society. You can think about the four years and three months working in the prison and having great success there as well. And the list can go on. Even in, in terms of HIV, the programs that I brought HIV in the early stages, people did not think they were HIV programs because they didn't have the right ribbon. But it was really about behavior change. And as the Prime Minister said, this is about behavior change. So I believe that with the experience, it puts me in a great position to be able to move the needle on crime in Barbados.